We are loved by an unending love. We are embraced by arms that find us. Even when we are hidden from ourselves, we are touched by fingers that soothe us, even when we are too proud for soothing. We are counseled by voices that guide us, even when we are too embittered to heal, we are loved by an unending love. We are supported by hands that uplift us, even in the midst of a fall. We are urged on by eyes that meet us, even when we are too weak for meeting. We are loved by an unending love. Embraced, touched, soothed, and counseled. Ours are the arms, the fingers, the voices. Ours are the hands, the eyes, the smiles. We are loved by an unending love. Before the, we start the first song, I just wanted to, uh, again, you probably already know them, but Tutti Druyan and Wondrian, uh, amazing, amazing, incredibly talented, singer and musician. Israel, 
I sing because God made music to lift our hearts and souls from the hollow depths of darkness to the highest heights of heaven, from the cold shadows of desire to the gates of radiant hope. I sing because God made music to make the moments of wonder, to sanctify the moments of sorrow, to soothe, to comfort, to gladden, to cradle us with infinite harmony, to rock us with eternal love. I sing because God made music to give our souls a trumpet, to give our wisdom a tambourine, to give our prayers a voice, to make our lives a song with the instruments of God's blessings. sins of the past. Rejoice in your repentance and your return. For this is the day that God made to lift you up from your sorrow and shame, to deliver you to the gates of righteousness. Remember this. Love is the crown of your life and wisdom the rock on which you stand. Charity is your staff and justice your shield. Your deeds declare your kindness and your works declare your devotion. Cry no more for your fears and your dread. Rejoice in your blessings and your healing. For this is the day that God made to raise your countenance and hope, to deliver you to the gates of holiness. You want to say anything about this song? The one that you find and ask us to sing? The next song. Well, if you want to say something, otherwise we can say something. Do you want to say something? You say something, absolutely. Be my guest. So there's, a, there, there's an artist, uh, Israeli one, 
which is ultra, ultra religious. I mean, the upbringing. Uh, he became a star a few years ago in something that uh, is, 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 is writing songs with the scriptures, but it's being heard on any radio station. It's like the thing to sing now. And we, d I, I knew him, but didn't know uh, too much about him. And then he done sent me this song, and um, in a different uh, in a different arrangement, somebody else's. And then I was looking up who wrote it, and I found it, and I, and we heard him Tutti and I sing this song. It just uh, it's just incredible. And you better to say what is what does it talk about, and then we can oh. sing it. Well, okay. <laughs> Um, we sang the song before um, in Rosh Hashanah. Um, we sang it in Hebrew. And today we're going to sing um, half of it in English. So um, I think you're going to, to hear exactly what, what it's about, what the feeling is. Um, but it's a prayer. It's a, it's a love. It's a, a prayer to God of how much we, we love God. And so yeah. Asking him to give us strength basically yes. at the, right mm -hmm. and, and as one mentioned this israeli singer is very unique because he's an orthodox jew mm -hmm. but he's one of the only singers in israel that really made a connection between secular and orthodox people we, everybody loves his music really really became is the connector mm -hmm. uh in in the song industry today in israel in the music You that knows the pain I'm in Who can heal the broken Brings light in darkness Makes peace and judgment You that guides my soul on the shore tell me that you will care for me I feel for my life promise me that I won't Yeah, 
Being a blessing. If you ask for rest, I will sit with you. If you ask for comfort, I will stay with you. If you ask for hope, I will yearn with you. If you ask for love, I will sing with you. If you ask for stillness, I will breathe with you. If you ask for peace, I will dream with you. If you ask for joy, I will laugh with you. If you ask for healing, I will pray with you. If you ask for warmth, I will become a blanket. If you ask for refuge, I will become a shelter. If you ask for help, I will become a blessing.
I love this song too. And now we turn to the, uh, the central part of our healing service, the Mishabir, prayer for healing. And what we'll do, Tuti and Ron, we play the, the song, I will open the ark, I'll ask you to rise. And if you wish to come and say a private personal prayer in front of the ark, it's a good time to do that. It's a, a pretty much a tradition uh, to have a chance to uh, go and say a private prayer next to the ark. Okay, so please rise. <clears throat> and you can do it at any time during the song, the prayer.
be seated. This is the season of healing, of healing our hearts and souls, of healing the moments we share with each other and the moments we share with ourselves. This is the season of memory, of remembering our parents and grandparents, the love of generations, the, ho the holiness of our ancestors. This is the season of stillness, the season of silence and quiet, of deep breath, of open eyes, of compassion and consolation. This is the season of healing, the season of grief turning to wonder, of loss turning toward hope, the season that binds this year to the next, the season that frees this year from the next, the season that heralds the redemption of spirit and the return to God's holy word. the 
one who makes peace in high heavens, make peace for us, all Israel, and all who inhabit the earth. And let us say, Amen. Shana Tova and Gemar Chatima Tova. We'll see you shortly with the afternoon service. You can stay in your seat. Five, ten minutes will start. Thank you. Thank you, Ron and Tutti.